Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. You came for us. I knew you would. Thank you. A thousand times, thank you. How are you doing, Kelly? I'm holding up. I just can't get the memories out of my head. I'm trapped. Suffocating. It's oozing into every pore. Faint sobs echoing the confined space. But I, I can't dwell on it. I'm okay now. I'm alive. Back to the old Kelly. That'll be all. Good luck out there, Shepard. I told you we'd tear the Collectors a new one. Yeah, Commander really pulled through. Hey, Shepard, glad that Collector Reaper crap is over. It is over, right? Think about the old Normandy and the trouble we get up to. Yeah, those seem like the good old days now, but come on, it was hell at the time. Geth, Saren, Sovereign, and then we got dumped. We're stuck in a weird place, sure, but back then it wasn't all sunshine and bunnies. That's it for now. See you, Commander. Collectors destroyed, base in ruins. Extremely impressive. Elusive man will be displeased. Fortunately, not human myself. Not my problem. Have you got a minute to talk? Yes, personal matters on mind, actually. Got call from nephew. Promising geneticist himself. Just turned 16, got tenure at university. Following in my footsteps. Had to lie about what I was doing. Think he was suspicious. Doesn't matter. Still good to hear his voice. Does anyone in your family know about what you really did for the government? No. No, I'm lying, but won't pry. Salarians curious as a people, but also have social cues. Keep two types of secrets from family. First type, personal or guilt-based. Invite suspicion, exploration, puzzle to be solved. Reward for curiosity, intelligence, drama. Other secrets, more serious. Dangerous if discovered. Signals discourage curiosity for protection of family. Why wouldn't everyone give clues that their secrets were too dangerous to be uncovered? Not conscious. Social, reflexive body language. You can't fake it. Example, yawning perceived as contagious among humans. Subject observes yawn. Sensory input deactivates left periamygdalar region. Subject yawns in response. Social empathy. Also works with dogs. Salarian faking signals to discourage curiosity, similar to human faking a yawn. Can try, but... Effectiveness limited. Are you calling him because you're worried we won't make it back? No. Aware survival unlikely, but actually contacted him for family connection. Hard to imagine galaxy. Too many people. Faceless. Statistics easy to depersonalize. Good when doing unpleasant work. For this fight, want personal connection. Can't anthropomorphize galaxy, but can think of favorite nephew fighting for him your nephew got tenure at 16 is he a genius or a scientific prodigy no wait don't want to insult him yes uh, but not in manner you meant remember salarian lives short but you're rapidly by your standards don't live much past 40. i'm glad you got to talk to family before we finish this and i'm glad we talked too morden Honored to be part of this, Shepard. Help preserve Galaxy before with Genophage. Dirty work. Ethically ambiguous. Problematic. Collector's mission simpler, cleaner. We'll be proud to see it in Morton's soulless biography bit. Unless we all die. Proud posthumously, in that case, regardless. Thank you. you to light up that base, Shepard. Hell of a way to tell the boss you're quitting. 
I wish I could have seen his face. It's not over, though. Bad guys on the horizon. And now Cerberus wants your tail. Never boring, huh? I don't know what kind of time we have, but we better dust off and stay ready. You sure as hell know how to make enemies. I understand you made quite an impact after you left the Alliance. Miranda and I stopped a Batarian plan to release a biological agent on the Citadel. That's when I first met her. It took us out to the Nemean Abyss and back. Save the Citadel like you, but what's the saying? A good deed's like pissing yourself in dark pants? Warm feeling, but no one notices. The whole thing was hushed like they're good at doing. But I know what I did, and I'm proud of it. We'll talk later. Commander. I wanted to tell you, I believe you did the right thing by destroying that base. The elusive man thinks he has the wisdom to utilize it, but he does not. I wanted to check in. I am always happy to talk with you. I'm interested in hearing more about Asari Justicars. in Asari culture. Justicars are from another era. Young Asari grow up watching vids about our adventures. Pure fiction, of course. Some Asari are uncomfortable with us, but so few Justicars exist that most have never met one. What role do you think Justicars have in Asari society? I would say that the closest human equivalent is a knight errant in your medieval lore. Perhaps mixed with a bit of samurai. Does the code forbid romantic involvement? It does not. However, I would never be interested in such. That part of my life is well behind me. You could meet someone who reawakens those desires. I am nearly 1,000 years old. I know myself and my desires. But your curiosity is quite welcome. What does your code say about killing? I am compelled to kill the wicked. If a Justicar is involved, peaceful solutions are long past. You make killing sound so casual. I remember each being I have slain. They are always in my thoughts. You know about Knights Errant and Samurai? When I knew I must leave Asari space again, I studied the history and morals of new species. When I was a maiden wandering the galaxy, humans had not yet arrived. What did your studies tell you about us? You are more individualistic than any other species I have encountered. If three humans are in a room, there will be six opinions. I like your species. I am curious to see what you will do. I should go. I'm glad we spoke. trouble with the migrant fleet. It's hard to see her upset. Edie has a wicked sense of humor. Or I should say, a really funny lack of one. Sometimes she seems like a person. But when it comes down to it, I can't get past her being a computer. This one security guy keeps staring at me. I think his name is Bert. I'm used to being watched by security, but they're usually staring at my eyes or watching my hands. I might have to start cloaking through the CIC from now on. Come back later. I'm sure I'll have more to talk about. You had to make a difficult choice, Shepard. For what it's worth, I believe you made the correct one. Have a few minutes to talk? If you wish. 
The last time we talked, you started speaking about a past event as if you were watching it. Drell have perfect memories. We can relive any moment in our lives with perfect clarity. It's difficult to control at times. Some of us disappear into, you know, let's call it solipsism. You can relive every assassination you've ever made? In perfect detail. Every mistake I made. Every target's last breath. That sounds difficult. At any moment, you could relive the guilt. Guilt? No. I've never felt any particular guilt about my contracts. My employers killed them. My body was only the tool they used. If you kill a man with your gun, do you hold the gun responsible? My gun can't decide right from wrong. You clearly do. My soul does. But my body is merely flesh. Flesh whose reflexes were honed to kill. Drell minds are different from humans. We see our body as a vessel, and accept that it is not always under our control. So you don't assume any responsibility for the things you do? Not every action performed by my body is a result of conscious choices. I take responsibility for those that are. Humans often believe in a soul distinct from the body. A spirit responsible for moral reasoning that lives on after the body's death. Our belief is just a bit more literal. The last time we talked, you remembered one of your assassinations. Something about sunset-colored eyes? Ah. Uh, that time. Laser dot trembles on the skull. Spice on the spring wind. Sunset eyes. Defiant in the scope. A bystander noticed my spotting laser and threw herself between me and the target. She couldn't see me, but she stared me down. It was odd that you just blurted that out. Just another vivid Drell memory? Not... no. She was a vivid person. The last time we talked, you remembered one of your assassinations. Something uh, about... A bystander noticed my spotting laser and threw herself between me and the Did target. you take the shot? Not that day. I should get back to my duties. Shepard, I appreciate these chats we have. You've spent a lot of your life alone, Thane. <laughs> Work fulfilled me. Reading. I barely spoke to anyone outside my family. It seems there will be no one to mourn me when I die. You're the only friend I've made in ten years. Friend, huh? That's a start. A start? That's... <laughs> intriguing. I will always be here to talk. the Collectors. I'm proud to serve under you, Commander. Hawthorne is still in the infirmary, though I think his pride is more broken than his bones. He tried so hard to help Joker. We had to do it, Shepard. Taking down the Collector base was the right decision. The elusive man might not agree, but we had no choice. Do you have a minute, Miranda? There's a lot to do, Shepard. Maybe another time. I'll let you work. Of course, Commander. You really are a hero. No sooner had the Collectors damned us than you were pulling our sorry asses right back out of hell. Your ace is in my book, Shepard. Thank you. For Sarah and now the Collectors, remind me never to get on your bad side, Shepard. I almost feel sorry for the Reapers. Have you got a minute? Can it wait for a bit? I'm in the middle of some calibrations. Talk to you later, Garrus. I'll be here if you need me. That's all for now. Logging you out, Shepard. I'm still a little shaken from my abduction by the Collectors. It was a lot to endure. You and Jeff came so quickly. I've never had truer friends. Thank you, Commander. An interesting choice, Shepard Commander. Your species was offered everything Geth aspired to. True unity, understanding, transcendence. 
You rejected it. You even refused the possibility of using the old machine's gifts to achieve it on your species' own terms. You are more like us than we thought. I'd like to find out more about you. Topic. When we took you aboard, I noticed you have a piece of N7 armor welded to you. Where'd you get it? It was yours. When you disappeared, we were sent to find you. We began where you first encountered the heretics. Eden Prime. After the old machine's attack, it was heavily defended. We were discovered. This is the impact of a rifle shot. How many other Geth were sent out to find me? We are the only mobile platform beyond the Veil. Organics fear us. We wish to understand, not in sight. One platform was judged sufficient. You've been looking for me for two years? We visited Therum, Pharos, Novaria, Vermeer, Ilos. A dozen unsettled worlds. The trail ended at Normandy's wreckage. You were not there. Organic transmissions claimed your death. We recovered this debris from your heart suit. That doesn't explain why you used my armor to fix yourself. There was a hole. But why didn't you fix it sooner, or with something else? No data available. this area of the ship. Normandy's cargo deck. That's all for now. Back for another lesson. Ever been to a Batarian prison? They don't trust you enough to sell you into slavery. That's why they send you. In there you got two choices. Bash your head open on the wall or kill everyone between you and the exit. I knew this girl once. Asari. Good head on the shoulders. We had this whole thing going. Until she sold me out to the blood pack. Put a sour note on the relationship. I should let you go. Talk more later, Shepard. I can't believe we destroyed the collector base. They said it couldn't be done. Then again, that said about a lot of things you do. Have you got time to talk? I really need to clean up this engine. Maybe later? I'll let you work. Talk to you later. So, Kenan, did you know we've got a crazy woman squatting down in the subdeck? What? If she touches anything, I'll kill her. Oh, and the only thing she wears from her waist up is tattoos. Oh, maybe I should go down and welcome her aboard. And she's a murderer, has biotic powers that could crush you with a blink. Hates everyone in Cerberus. Damn it, girl. Stop toying with me. Thanks for coming to get us, Commander. I felt myself slipping away. You arrived just in time. Thank you. Carry on. Will do, Commander. Hey. What's happening? Shepard, we talked enough. You're just pissing around. No hard feelings, but I don't want to play. I should go. Whatever. instead of handing it to Cerberus. Ha! <laughs> Something to think about. If you killed the most dangerous thing in the galaxy, that leaves us. 
That's all for now. Shepard. You'll have to wait for the next shuttle. You... Can I help you, ma'am? No, thank you. Just passing through. Next! Yes? I should be going. You need anything else, let me know. Something I can do for you, Shepard? I better go. My door is always open. The Shepard Memorial Plaza on Elysium was voted this year's hottest wedding location. Under Admiral Hackett's orders, money raised from wedding fees goes to funds for Alliance veterans.
we were always told that Ilium is one of the safest places in the galaxy until you fell off the grid. Sign the wrong contract, join up with the wrong company, or walk How much it will cost? See you again. So, what can I do for you? How's your own work going? The data you gave me was extremely helpful. It gave me a target. The Shadow Broker has several contacts here on Ilium. The most powerful is someone called the Observer. Taking down the Observer will put me closer to the Shadow Broker. I could use your help. Tell me what I can do to help. Your data pointed me at logs kept by Shadow Broker agents. The logs were deleted, but it may be possible to reconstruct some of it. The Shadow Broker is cautious. His agents are referred to only by their title and race. My inquiries have narrowed the Observer down to one of five operatives. A Turian, a Salarian, a Krogan, a Batarian, and a Vorcha. If you can refine the list, I'll know where to strike. Do you have any specifics on these agents? I'm afraid not. Nixeris was lucky to get as much as she did. I was happy to help, ma'am. The data is our only hope of determining which one is the Observer. And if we wait too long, they'll all disappear. Let me go talk to these people. I'll get the name you need. This is a delicate operation, Shepard. If you shake down one agent, the others will go to ground, and my chance will be lost. Liara is right. We need to get enough evidence to strike, and we need it soon. I'm more than capable of handling the violence, Shepard. I need your help gathering the data. I'll reconstruct the data and tell you what I find. Thank you, Shepard. When you find something, call me on the radio channel we used in the old days. I can't risk handling this in person. I'll talk to you later, Liara. Let me search for more data. I'll get back to you. Thank you. Let me know what you find. How can you short sell on prefabs after these human colony attacks? charity business, followed by a freeze as new colony plants dry up. Just watch. No! No! This is the best you have, I'll make do. But you're certain the neural stimulators are compatible with both my suit and Asari physiology? Absolutely. In fact, I use this model of Hennessy.
Police are annual list of Ilium's ten richest people. Are the heavens still bright? The bullets finally fall to the top. And don't miss our look at the fashion faux pas at the Commerce Awards held last week. All this and more. Let me search for more data. I'll get back to you. Thank you. Let me know what you find. You deserve somebody who respects you. Somebody who's going to treat you right. Oh, I think I'm just going to stop dating for a while. No, don't do that. Don't let some humans go. Never believe what happened. I've got the data. Don't ask. Just call it a gift. We just spread the word. The family will be okay. Trust me, the goods coming in from the Terminus systems are great for business. I don't know. Some of them seem dangerous. That's the whole point. Danger. She's the last of a dying breed. Won't be many pure blood Asari left in a few generations. I feel kind of sad for her. Don't. I heard she married an Asari herself. Had pure blood kids. She's part of the problem. For example, you know that new drug? The one that causes permanent neural scarring? That's horrible. There's a 12-page contract for shipping, then a waiver for you. What about you? Going to try and make it as a commando? Why not? Every Asari has biotics. Her first mate. Your father? He got her things when he traveled. It's not a competition, Dad. You don't even really remember him. It's just... We're looking for weapons. Shouldn't you be taking this seriously? Hey, I'm 60 years old and finally out of my parents' house. And you can sell something that dangerous with just a contract and a waiver? These are the Terminus systems. Everything's dangerous and everything's for sale. Either we tax and monitor it to keep it in control, or we'll just suffer and get a monopoly.
All five of the suspects are male. The observer is female. Something's not right. Who gave you this lead? My assistant, Nick Saris. She got the information. Nick Saris gave me the information. Nick Saris, could I see you in here for a moment? Shepard, I'll talk to you later. Shepard, it's good to see you again. Nixeras had some interesting data hidden away. Thank you, Shepard. I wouldn't have caught her without you. I'm one step closer to the Shadow Broker thanks to you. Here. Nixeras was very well compensated. You need it more than I do. Did you have any trouble with Nixeras? She was very talented. I imagine that had she been ordered to assassinate me, I had never seen her coming. But her barriers needed practice. Practice I'm afraid she won't be getting. What's the next step in your hunt? Now I gather information, peel away layers of lies, and shine light into the shadows. And when I find the Shadow Broker, I hit him with a biotic field so strong that what's left of his body will fit into a coffee cup. That anger can't be just from what you've told me. What else happened between you and the Shadow Broker? Did Cerberus ever tell you how they recovered your body? I gave it to them. I gave you to them, Shepard. Because they said they could rebuild you. And to do that, I had to take it from the Shadow Broker, who was going to sell your corpse to the Collectors. Why didn't you tell me about this before now? Because I screwed it up, Shepard. I barely escaped with my own life. And when I gave you to Cerberus, I told myself I was doing it for you. For a chance to bring you back. But I knew Cerberus would use you for their own business. And I let it happen. Because I couldn't let you go. I'm sorry. You did the right thing, Liara. My mission is important. I couldn't do it if you hadn't given me to Cerberus. Thank you. I... I was afraid you'd hate me. So that's why I must destroy the Shadow Broker. For what he did to my friend, and to you, and whatever he's doing with the Collectors. Be careful out there, Liara. Don't turn into the thing you're hunting. Says the dead Spectre working for Cerberus. Don't worry, Shepard. I'm not my mother. Everything I'm doing, I'm doing of my own free will. For better or for worse. No. Is there anything else I can help you with? I know you're looking for the Shadow Broker. Cerberus gave me data on where to find him. Interested? Absolutely. I had no idea. Let me see what you've got. It looks like a leaked transmission between Shadow Broker operatives. Some hints as to the location and... It's about Farron. He's still alive. Your friend? The one who helped recover my body from the Shadow Broker? The same. He sacrificed himself to save me. I'd never found anything suggesting he was alive. After two years, I hadn't even dreamed. Sounds like you and Farron were close. It's funny. He betrayed me more than once. He was double dealing for Cerberus, for the Shadow Broker. But in the end, he sacrificed himself for me. I owe him. If he's been the Shadow Broker's prisoner for two years, he may not be in good shape. I know. But yesterday, all I wanted was the chance to avenge his death. Today, he's alive. I'll do whatever I have to do to get him back. Any friend of yours is a friend of mine. What's the next step? I... I don't know. I need to prepare to think. I'm going home. Use my terminal if you need any local intel. You okay? I've spent two years plotting revenge. Now I have the chance to make it a rescue. Let me help. I'll come by your apartment. Okay. Hopefully I'll have a plan by then. Thank you, Shepard.
don't know. That still sounds like an awful thing to legalize. All the dangers are right. Okay, listen. Give Fax a full refund. Do you hear me? He knows. I don't know how. It doesn't matter. Credit him a full refund now. And then get your ass someplace safe. <laughs> those trace samples and get them back to the lab. We got multiple shots fired. Yeah, techs are going over the place now. Central, we got an open carrier on this end, switching to a coded relay. What's going on? This area is sealed off. Please step back, ma'am. Sealed off? Why? Someone tried to kill your friend, Commander Shepard. Thank you, officer. Your people are dismissed. You can't do that. Already done. Tila Vasir, Special Tactics and Recon. A Spectre? I heard your status was reinstated. Good. You're one of our most famous operatives. Might even get you to sign my chest plate. So, I assume you had business with your friend this evening, Commander. Liara was following a lead on the Shadow Broker. The Shadow Broker? Dangerous enemy to have. What are the facts so far? About 25 minutes ago, someone took a shot at Tissoni. Note the bullet holes. She stuck around for almost four minutes before leaving the building. Whatever she was doing was important. If Liara isn't here, where is she? If I knew that, I wouldn't be sifting through her crap. There's no blood, no body. It looks like Tissoni got away. The sniper didn't plan on her kinetic barrier. Clever girl. Paranoid, but clever. Did the police find anything when they arrived? Just the mess and the bullet holes. I gave them a gold star for finding the bullet holes. Liara was expecting me. She would have left a message here. Her office wasn't safe. I'm not surprised. Ilium is just Omega with expensive shoes. I haven't found anything useful for tracking her down yet. You knew Tissoni better than I do. Where would she have hidden her backups? Let me take a look around. Yeah, that's not the Asari homeworld. I'm not sure what planet that is. It's Ilos. used to do that wasn't standard issue. The kinetic barrier deflected the shots, but they still managed to penetrate the glass. It's part of my old armor. Looks like someone didn't like you much either. A doctorate from the University of Ceres at Anthesia. She's getting good use out of all that education. The picture changed when you touched it. It must be keyed to your ID. What does it show now? It's a Prothean dig site. Liara did leave a message. There are a few Prothean-looking objects around the apartment. Let's see what we can find. Those things must be worth a fortune. She was certainly into ugly. Vasir, I've got something here. Disc. 
Let's try it on her terminal. It looks like she recorded a call. What have you got for me, Sikat? It was tricky, but you paid for the best. I can narrow it down to a cluster, maybe even a system. How soon can you have it? Shouldn't take long. Come to my office. Barrier Frontiers in the Dracon Trade Center. Gotta say, though, to Sony, you're making me a little nervous. How big is the trouble that could come out of this? Relax, Sikat. I'll see you in a few hours. This must be important. The Shadow Brokers people already tried to kill her once. I know where the Dracon Trade Center is. My car's outside. Let's go. Frontier's offices are located on the third floor. I don't hear police chatter. We must have missed the party. Liara's in there! There. Now it's getting fun. They just took out three floors to make sure she's dead. I'll grab this guy car and seal off the building from the top. I'll start down here and work my way up. Just leave some for me. What happened? The blast knocked me up. Was it a bomb? What happened? Who are you? What's going on? Please exit the building in an orderly fashion. Emergency power engaged. Serving industry for over 120 years, uh, the Drake Aon Trade Center takes pride uh, in being the home to Ilium's corporate elite. Thanks to us, companies like X Solar Shipping, they think they think. Barrier Frontier employee. So we got caught in the explosion. And Vizier, the elevators are out and building security is down. No alarms, no police. Very professional. Set bombs, killing everyone. Casualty here. Looks like he's got bullet wounds. Watch yourself, Vizier. They used military grade hardware. Bullet wounds? Guess this was more than just an explosion. Life isn't about arriving, it's about the ride along the way. At Nizo, every vehicle is an island of style and an engine for freedom. Nizo transportation. Solar Shipping is the leading industry authority on resource logistics and management. We are committed to providing clients with secure, affordable, and efficient solutions to all their transportation needs. Exolar Shipping. Anywhere, on time. Every time. I found a military-grade explosive device. It hasn't been armed. Sloppy work. You use that kind of hardware when you don't have time to plan. Vizier, I'm at the Barrier Frontiers office. We are assigned in just a few minutes ago. Understood, Welcome Commander. Welcome Barrier Frontiers. Let us be your guide to limitless possibilities.
Here. These damaged pipes are on fire. They're blocking the stairs. Look for a switch to act. Got it. Should be clear now. Good. I'm on my way down. Hold on. Interesting. If I'd have been a few seconds faster, I could have stopped them. Is this a cat? Must have been. No sign of that data Liara talked about. Looks like a dead end. Uh, speaking of which, did you find your friend's body? You mean this body? Liara? Something I should know? This is the woman who tried to kill me. You've had a rough day, so I'll let that slide. Why don't you put that gun down? I saw you. I doubled back after I left. I watched you break into my apartment. You didn't know where Liara went because she hid the message. You needed me to find it for you. Thanks for the help. Once she had my location, she signaled the Shadow Broker's forces. They bombed the building to take me out. She found Sakat, took his data, and killed him. 
I'm guessing she's still got the disc on her. Good guess. Not that you'll ever see what's on it. You pure blood bitch! There she is. I'm right. No wait left. I'm on her. Charges. I noticed. She's got reinforcements. What kind of guns do 
does this thing have? It's a taxi. It has a fare meter. Wonderful. Truck. I know. Truck! I know! There we go. You're enjoying this. A head-on collision at this speed. Yeah, I knew this would be bad for you. Truck! Again? Vizier's car. Come on, she can't have gotten far. Watch out. They're dropping reinforcements in to slow us down. Lock the door! Climb over to get to Vizier's car.
I'll take it. What kind of hotel is this? Azure. It's a luxury resort with an exotic edge. Azure is slang for a part of the Asari body in some areas of Ilium. Where? Mainly the lower reaches, near the bottom. I meant, where on the Asari body? So did I. Hey, we're unharmed. We didn't see anything. She's lost a lot of blood. We have to be getting close. She's tough, I'll give her that much. She's a specter. those people that you want to live. Please. We'll get you out of here safely, Mariana. Well, that's good to hear. All you had to do was walk away. Now it gets ugly. Please, I have a son. A son? I hope he gets to see you again. I've heard losing a parent is just horrific for children. Scars them for life. I'm going to end you, Fazir. It's okay, Liara. We'll handle it usual way. You want Mariana's little boy to grow up without a mommy, Shepard? Thermal clips on the ground now. Power cells, too. Is that it? What? Vasir, I sacrificed hundreds of human lives to save the Destiny Ascension. I unleashed the Rachni on the galaxy. So for your sake, I hope your escape plan doesn't hinge on me hesitating to shoot a damn hostage. You're bluffing. Now, Leo. You've been spotted. This will be fun. Thank <laughs> you. 
Personal data pad. This has what we need to find the Shadow Broker. You're dead. The Shadow Broker has been in power for decades. He's stronger than anything you've ever faced. Is that why you sold out the Council to work for him? You think I betrayed the Council? Like Saren? Go to hell. The Broker's given me damn good intel over the years. Intel that saved lives and kept the Citadel safe. So if the Broker needs a few people to disappear, I'll pay that price without hesitation. Spectres don't blow up buildings filled with innocent people. Sure we do. We get our hands dirty so the Council doesn't have to. The Councilors might complain about our methods to soothe their consciences, but they never look too closely. Besides, you're with Cerberus. You have any idea what your terrorist friends have done? I know who they are and what they've done. It doesn't matter. I think it does. You want to judge me? Look in the mirror. Kidnapping kids for biotic death camps? Killing Alliance admirals who ask questions? And you're with them? Don't you dare judge me. Oh. Don't you? Sony had retrieved the data. Civilian casualties not a concern. 
Bazir's dead. I'm putting the data through to the Normandy's computers. We can be at the Shadow Broker's base in a few hours. He'll know about Vizier before long. If he decides to kill Farron. We won't give him time. We'll need the Normandy's stealth systems to get us in close undetected. The Shadow Broker's agents are still shooting their way through Ilium. With luck, they won't notice we've left until it's too late. What's the plan when we get there? Get in, get Farron, get out. And kill anyone who tries to stop us. That's it? That's it. Sounds like a plan. lives in this? His ship follows the sunset, completely undetectable in the storm, unless you know where to look. How do we get inside? The shuttle bay is locked down. We'll need to land on the ship and hunt for a hatch. But we can't stay outside for long. There's a constant lightning storm where the hot and cold air collide. <laughs> array near the back of the ship. There's nothing below but maintenance equipment. We have to find an entrance near the back shielding. Maintenance drones. Why are they attacking? They must think we're debris from the storm. Excuse me, 
neutralize the drone. that can crack it. How long will it take? I don't know, Shepard. I've never broken into the Shadow Broker's base before. Well, not this one, anyway. Nothing can hurt me! You sure that shunt is working? It's illegal, even on Ilium. It didn't come with a warranty. But you tested it, right? Here come more of them. Tell me you tested it. Watch the authority. Next. Liara! I'm sure it won't be much longer. Remember the old days when you could just slap Omni Gel on everything? That security upgrade made a lot of people unhappy. Look out, more on the way.
did the Shadow Broker have? Told you. ship's layout. We're headed toward the prison block. And Farron... Getting you out of here. No. Farron. What the hell is the broker trying to do to you? The equipment is sensitive to tampering. This chair plugs into the broker's info network. You have to shut off the power. Pull me out now and my brain cooks. Do you know where we can cut the power? It won't be easy. You'll have to go to Central Operations. What's the point of this cage? I don't... It's a neural grounding rod. The medical equipment is to make sure he doesn't... expire. We have to shut this place down! Where did the broker get the mercs? Raised his own private force. They're completely loyal. Shepard, we really don't have the time. Easy or not, we're all getting out of here. Good. Central Operations is down the hall. You know the Shadow Broker's waiting for you, right? I'm counting on it. We'll be back for you, Farron. I'll try not to go anywhere. I want all teams to help those seeds. Get an LOS. Paint the marks. Oh. 
Watch the assault. Incoming! <laughs> Bombing on Ilium wasn't exactly subtle. Extreme, but necessary. No, it wasn't. Neither was caging Ferrin for two years. Dr. Tassoni, your interference caused all this. Ferrin betrayed me when he handed you Shepard's body. The drill is simply paying the price. Be smart. Let Ferrin walk out with us. You're quite confident for someone with nowhere left to hide. You travel with fascinating companions, Doctor. Thank you for bringing the Okir's project to Sony. His dissection will be interesting. You're not putting a hand on anyone. It's pointless to challenge me, Asari. I know your every secret while you fumble in the dark. Is that right? You're a Yogg. A pre-space flight species quarantined to their homeworld from massacring the Council's first contact teams. This base is older than your planet's discovery. Which probably means you killed the original Shadow Broker 60 years ago, then took over. I'm guessing you were taken from your world by a trophy hunter who wanted a slave. Or a pet. How am I doing? Genetically sensitive. Energy and projectiles are bouncing off. And we do this the hard way. Hit him now!
Resume standard procedures. I want a status report on all operations within the next solar day. Shadow Broker, out. Goddess of Oceans, it's you. You... how? Well, everyone who's ever seen him in person is dead, so... You're the new Shadow Broker. Is taking over as the Shadow Broker really a good idea? It was either that or lose everything. His contacts, his trading sources, those will really help us. With the Shadow Broker's information network, I can... I can give you... I can... I'll check the power systems. We've got no 
safeguards or user restrictions. It's like he never anticipated anyone but himself being here. And it's all ours. What kind of information are we talking about? I'm not sure. I'll need to go through his files. Come back later and I'll try to have something useful for you. All I wanted was to rescue Farron, but is it wrong that part of me wants this? With the Shadow Brokers network, I can help you. Maybe I can turn this operation into something better. Don't be a stranger this time. Come by when you have a chance. The doors are always open. Shadow Broker. What's this? That's the old broker's VI assistant. It's actually been helpful with rebuilding the network. Please let me know if I can organize anything else for you, Shadow Broker. It also thinks anyone in the room is the broker. I'll play around with the settings later. My manual is ready whenever you have a moment. Council member's mistress has made some unusual purchases lately. She may be expecting to move to a larger mansion. to be honest. The Shadow Broker had more resources than you can imagine. Here, come on over. He had top-level access to the Turian and Asari governments. And more than one Salarian Dalatros traded intel. And now it's ours. You're not gonna turn into a recluse with creepy information on everyone in the galaxy, are you? I can understand the temptation. 
I've got all the secrets of the galaxy at my fingertips. Give me ten minutes and I could start a war. But I've got a purpose. Helping you stop the Reapers. That will keep me honest. You know, relatively speaking. If you're in over your head, we could just crash this thing and walk away. That's just it. In a way, I feel like I belong here. Working on my own, I was always hunting for leads. With the Shadow Broker's resources, it's about organizing, cataloging. I've got everything, Shepard. This is a dream job. Although, the location could be better. Have you found anything useful yet? The Shadow Broker knew about the Reapers. Perhaps that's why he offered to help prove Saren's guilt to the Council. He didn't want Saren to succeed. He also knew that the Collectors were Protheans, repurposed to be Harbinger's puppets. There's even some data on the Protheans. I think he knew what was coming and was looking for a way to survive. Why was he still looking at Protheans? They gave us the warning in the conduit at Ilos, but we've used those. The Shadow Brokers seemed to think there was more out there. Perhaps the Protheans had other plans. Or maybe he was just grasping at anything that offered some hope. How's Farron doing? As well as you'd expect, after two years of intermittent torture. He gonna be okay? I don't know. He wants to work, so I'm letting him help. Maybe it takes his mind off it. So, you and Farron? No. He's been through a traumatic ordeal. He's emotionally fragile and needs to heal. He's very grateful to me for saving him. But it would be irresponsible of me to take advantage of that. How'd you know what the Shadow Broker was? I didn't. I had no idea what to expect when we finally found him. But I researched pre-spaceflight cultures during some of my Prothean studies. I know a bit about the Yogg. There's more on the terminals if you want to look. They're a fascinating culture, and a terrifying one. It was good talking with you, Liara. Let me know if you need anything. I think what I need right now is a friend. I can't leave for too long, but spending all my time on this ship. Maybe next time you come by, I could come up to the Normandy. Did you enjoy the tour? Yes, it's a beautiful ship. And I ran into Joker. He seemed happy to see me. Although, he did ask if I'd embraced eternity lately. Of course he did. I also spoke with Dr. Chalkwaz. I'm glad she's doing well. I brought you something. It took some digging, but I recovered your tags. see these again. They changed hands more than once. Do you remember Admiral Hackett? He gave them to me so I could return them to you. He sends his best and hopes you're okay. So how are you doing, Shepard? I mean, really. Not what you tell your squad to keep morale up. Between you and me, I have no idea how we're gonna do this. 
I'm doing everything I can, but... You've done more than most. You and your team destroyed the Collectors and walked out alive. We fought them in their own base and we won. They can't call us young or primitive anymore. Young? You know, I'm 108. 109 in a couple of months. Oh, I should get you something nice. You're alive again. I've got everything I want. So tell me what you want. What are you fighting for? I guess I'm fighting for us. All of us. That's a lot of responsibility. People are messy. Awkward. Sometimes selfish or cruel. But they're trying. And I'm gonna make sure they have a chance. I hope the galaxy proves itself worthy of the effort you're putting into saving it. I should get back to my base, but thanks for inviting me up, Shepard.